Hi there folks, I'm Simon here again, Ariège Pipe Smoker. Um, just a quick um, call in, catch up I guess. Um, yeah, absolutely miserable weather outside, so um, yeah, confined to the house for the day. Which is okay, because I've just had, oh I don't know, about 30 pipes turn up in the post. So yeah, going to be um, a busy weekend. Um, I'll show you the pipes in a minute. Um, yeah, just smoking the old Dr. Plum Bulldog, a bit of um, HH, uh, like Baron's HH, Pure Virginia. Which is growing on me more and more, actually. When I first got it, yeah, I, I had um, the Samuel Goweth Full Virginia Flake, Capstan Blue, Capstan Yellow, the HH, Pure Virginia. And out of all the um, Virginia flakes, actually, I found the um, the HH one was was my least favourite. Favourite, and I thought it was a bit um, yeah, that's good, but maybe a little bit average compared to the others. Um, but it's growing on me more and more, actually. Um, so yeah. But anyway, a um, couple of shout outs. Um, first shout out is for the Big Joe Pipe Show. Um, yeah, he's got a, a hundred subscriber giveaway going on. Um, you don't even have to do a VR. Uh, it's just just a case of um, mention yourself in the comments kind of thing. Uh, but I thought I'd give him a shout out anyway because if he's um, kind enough to do a giveaway without even wanting a VR, then the guy deserves a shout out. Um, haven't seen many of your videos yet. Um, Sunday mornings tends to be my um, YTPC video catch up. <laughs> um, but yeah, go and check his channel out. Um, I'll put a link um, in, in the bucket description down below. And I can't believe he's only got 100 subscribers. Should have more than 100. <laughs> Other shout out. Um, it's very awesome, actually. Um, I recently discovered and have joined the Pipe Club of India. Um, now those of you who have seen some of my videos will probably um, know that I've been to India many times. Um, and it's, it's a kind of, I say an ambition or, or a goal, but yeah, I, I would really love to go back to India when we were allowed and uh, take this channel with me um, because I'm convinced in all the antique shops that are buried around Delhi and Mumbai, there's going to be um, some colonial era pipes if I go rummaging. Um, and I think that would make some uh, quite interesting footage. So yeah, it's, it's been great to um, meet some pipe smokers in India. Um, obviously, that's, that's going to be invaluable um, to get to know where the few and far between um, tobacconists are. And... Yeah, obviously it'd be, be great to meet up with some some of these guys um, when, I'm, when I'm back over there. So, and so shout out to the Pipe Club of India. And a very cool thing, one of the admins, um, Ian, I think it's Ian Walker, I can't quite remember, um, has listed my YouTube channel and my Etsy shop on the Pipe Club of India's official website. So that's, uh, that's awesome. Thank you very much for that. Um, yeah, I think I think to join the Pipe Club of India, you either have to be um, Indian or of Indian origin or have a strong connection to India, you know, like if you've worked there, travelled there, family connections, etc, etc. So if you fulfil any of those criteria, check out the Pipe Club of India. Um, yeah, well, I guess it's uh, an opportune moment to um, move on to the Hall of Pipes. It's just arrived. So, it's a reposition. Pipes, pipes everywhere. Yeah, it's quite nice, interesting ones in here, actually. Put that down a second. This one I've nearly finished cleaning it up. Sir John Aylesbury, um, 95 Sterling Spigot. Really nice pipe, actually, that. Um, this one I've just finished. It's uh, a pimpernel red, and it did have 
it had a really big ugly flaw here and because it's not a particularly expensive pipe I thought I'd put some rustication in there it looks better than it did but yeah um, funny little nose warmer torpedo thing um, but yeah there's some interesting ones here actually there's a nice meerschaum I'm not sure if it's an amber stem I'm, I'm going to have to have a look on the internet and see um, see how to see if a stem is amber it's a nice um, what make is that again? I can't read it nice leather clad it's very very good condition actually yeah, various other interesting ones. Little uh, Sam Blasty Jean Tet. A nice uh, ornate stem. Yeah, various bits and pieces. Nice rop. Um, I think this will be a, a good one for St. Patrick's Day. I don't know if you're going to get that. It's like a green a green um, stain. And a bent Dublin, I guess that shape is. 9mm filter. But yeah, I'll get that smartened up. Hopefully that will be a good listing for St. Patrick's Day. Yeah, and various other bits and bobs. That's quite a nice um, chacom, actually. Getting that stem cleaned up. There's a couple of unsmoked ones as well, actually. Um, and actually, I, I, I'm not even going to attempt... I don't think I'm going to be able to... So I'm not going to attempt. Let's attempt what we are not going to attempt. Now I can't get the lighting. Um, whoever had this collection originally, there's a few in it. Are you going to be able to get that? You see, it has a. You can just about pick it up. I think it actually has a double drilling um, into the chamber, uh, which is quite novel, I guess. Um, and it's not something I've come across actually personally before. However, that one has a double drilling. Um, this one of the horn stem also has a double drilling into the chamber. And I think this this has a double drilling into the chamber as well. Um, quite a nice big... Um, it's a Carré's Magic Inch and I... They have this really weird system of letting the air into the stem, and the stems aren't very good actually. Um, but this is actually a nice size billiard, and I think I have another stem actually. I, I could um, just put a standard stem on it and bypass the Carey's Magic Inch system because it's not so popular, um, not so good. So it's another unsmoked pipe. Um, So yeah, there's a, a nice um, Don Billiard. So yeah, that's um, that's kind of um, my work cut out for the weekend. Get get as many of these as cleaned up as I can. Get them listed. Um, so yeah, I hope you have a nice weekend, folks. Just thought I'd have a quick, quick stop by, and um, yeah. So, um, it's early in the morning. Uh, I can't think of anything to say. <laughs> so check out um, Big Joe's Smoke, uh, Smoke Show. Um, give him a sub. Um, say hello. Uh, yeah, check out the Pipe Club of India. And, yeah, keep keep, keep an eye out on the Etsy shop. Um, yeah, I mean, it's uh, when I say keep an eye out on the Etsy shop, um, it's just uh, if people are interested... It's kind of, um, it's where all the photographs are of the pipes when I'm finished. So, you know, I try and take quite good photos. Um, and so, uh, yeah, if those of you are interested how these cleaned up, the best place to see see the photographs is the Etsy shop. I mean, I do have an Instagram, but I not really, don't really understand the point of Instagram. I do put the odd photo up. But, uh, yeah, okay then, folks, have a nice weekend. Um, hope you enjoy your pipes. Um, yeah, and uh, see you in a few days. Take care now.